we're mapping the Dornock Firth uh, using a range of uh, subtidal and intertidal mapping techniques uh, using drones, uh, multi-beam sonar, uh, dive surveys, and that's all to compile a baseline survey uh, so we can see what the Dornock Firth looks like now and then compare that to how it may look in the future. So I studied the larvae of the oyster, that's the babies, and what we want to know is now that the oysters are in the water and when we put more, where are these babies going to go? So um, they could stay close to the mother oysters or go further away into the whole Murray Firth. And like that we will be able to see which one would be the best location to put new oysters in the water so that there's a lot of population connected.